This video will demonstrate the four row repeat for the slip stitch honeycomb pattern, which I've started here. We'll start with row one of our repeat, working on the right side of the pattern, and we are simply going to knit all the stitches across. It's important to note that this pattern works on odd numbers of cast on stitches, so we're going to knit that odd number of stitches across. For our second row of the repeat, we're going to turn our work and we will alternate knitting and slipping stitches to contribute to the texture of the honeycomb. Now we'll knit as usual for our first stitch. And next we're gonna slip our next stitch. We're still gonna hold our yarn in back but we're going to slip as if we're purling. And then we'll repeat those two stitches across our row. So that is a knit, slip as if to purl with our yarn in back and continue across. For our third row, we'll again just knit right across. And the fourth and final row of our repeat, we will turn our work and we're going to repeat that knit slip stitch pattern, but we're first gonna offset it by knitting not just our first stitch, but our first two stitches. So it staggers the placement of those slipped stitches. So we'll knit two, slip one, and then we're gonna to return to just our knit one, slip one. Knit one, slip one, knit one, slip one. And we'll continue that across to the end, but just like we started this row, with two knit stitches, we will end with two as well. Last two stitches, we will knit. Now for the remainder of the length of our work, we'll simply repeat those four rows.